Spoiler warning, this video contains spoilers of the manga, so you have been warned. Yo, guys, you heard me right. Elba fruit. Look, I've been rewatching One Piece lately, and recently I came past this arc called Little Garden. And as you guys know, what is the most prominent thing in that arc? Yes, giants. And when I watched that arc, I came with one of the most crazy diabolical theories ever because of a particular line in that arc. And I don't know if someone already made a theory video about this but trust me i came up with this theory on my own and made the theory myself like a month or two ago but i just didn't have the time to make a video until now but anyways you're probably like bro shut up tell me the line you heard well the line was this if a quarrel breaks out in my village and you can't settle it on your own, then we beseech our god Elbof for his judgment. Elbof is just and bestows divine protection on those in the right. He'll ensure the survival of the righteous. Now what does this mean? Well, it's very simple. It means that the giants believe in this god called Elbof, the god of war. Now a couple chapters ago we learned about how devil fruits came to be. It is the desires of the humans to oversimplify it. Now a good example is Nika the sun god. A lot of people believed in Nika the sun god so the devil fruit came to be because of it. Now that means that there has to be a Elbof Elbof fruit or human human fruit model Elbof, the god of war. And that's a fact. Now the next question is, does someone have that particular fruit or did someone have that fruit in the past? But before that, let's make hypothetical abilities this fruit might bestow on the user. Now let's talk about the facts first, some of the things the fruit has to give you. And that is a sense of justice. And that's because Nika Nika gives you laughter because once you awaken the fruit, it takes over the user and in Nika's case, it's the laughter and good mood. But as we know, the Elbaf God is believed to be just and bestows divine protection on those in the right. So the user, once he awakens the fruit, must become righteous. But to what extent? I don't know because righteousness is not concrete and people have their own corrupted form of justice. I mean, look at the world government. Now, what else does the fruit do? I would guess it would make you a giant, probably the biggest giant there is, excluding Szechuan Wolf or San Juan Wolf, I don't know how you pronounce that, because that's not his actual size. It's just the giant fruit ability. So let's just say 50 meters. It will also probably give you immense strength, like you can probably easily level islands. It will also make you a master at wars because it is the god of war fruit. The downsides would probably be that it would make you so prideful and just that you cannot simply defeat someone. You probably need to have a fair battle with someone or else you would probably not engage. Now let's go to the potential users that might have it or had it in the past. One could be Joy Boy's friend or ally in the Decaland, and maybe the great 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 grandpa of Jaguar de Sol. Maybe he was the user and fought during the war in the Void Century. Another one could be the Prince of Elbaf. We don't know much about him and he might be a user of the fruit and that's why he's the prince. Another one could be Zebek. We don't know anything about him but, but what we do know is that my man had Kaido, Whitebeard, Big Mom and Shiki at his fingertips. To have these units you have to have something and that might have been the Elba fruit. Another one could be the God Knights that have been recently revealed. As you know their name is God Knights and that could be because they are the Knights of the Celestial Dragons but that could also be because they all possess a God fruit like the Forest God fruit, the Earth God fruit and the Elba fruit which like <laughs> bro that would be crazy and awesome if that was the case and I hope it is and and that would make them stronger than Yonkus, probably. Like, <laughs> bro, I'm getting so hyped even talking about this. But what do you guys think? Did I hit the nail on this one or am I talking bullcrap? What are your thoughts about who would be the user of this crazy elbow fruit? If you enjoyed, leave a like and subscribe. More vids are coming and as always, keep existing.